regrets. Uh, and as Mike's already indicated, I'll be staying till the end of the season. I do have a few thank yous. Um, I've already thanked the executive and Gil and Tony Peake, um, wise counsel and an old head, my predecessor Wayne Jackson and Ian Collins who made my, um, my welcome at the AFL so easy. Uh, Wayne was a great help, pushed me up uh, into this role and Ian Collins certainly helped me when he left to go and head up Colonial Stadium as it was then known. To Jeff Slattery and Brian Walsh uh, for their constant advice, support and friendship. Uh, my three older brothers uh, who have been fantastic in their support. Simone's mother Sue who's here today and her stepfather York who have been great helpers. We've raised our four children. To my PA Yolanda Ferguson who came across from the AFL Players Association. Uh, we've been uh, doing this for over 15 years. I also want to thank uh, our state leagues for their support, the volunteers, the clubs, the presidents, the CEOs made some great friends, uh, the players, the coaches and even some of the legends who I've really respected their way, they've always offered me a bit of advice here and there, the Ron Barassis, Alan Aylett, uh, the John Kennedys, Charlie Sutton when he was alive, just those little comments, little text messages have always been so appreciated. I sincerely want to thank uh, the media. Um, I've always said that this game is blessed by fantastic media coverage and we get on balance 95% of enormous coverage that is positive and for that I'm very grateful. And to print, TV, radio, online, whatever the media platform, our game is infinitely served, has been infinitely served so well by the way the media has covered this game. I genuinely respect your role in our game. And I want to thank our broadcast partners, and in particular Rupert Murdoch, Kerry Stokes, the late Kerry Packer, and James Packer, who have backed this game, supported this game both financially and throughout our whole time that I've been associated with the AFL. I want to thank our corporate partners, the venue operators, the governments of all persuasion, whether it's federal, state, local, that have supported our game, and in particular, the four Prime Ministers that I've hosted at Grand Finals, uh, John Howard, Kevin Rudd, Julia Gillard and Tony Abbott. They've all been great supporters of our game, all been great contributors to the game and spent taxpayers' money helping us do what we've wanted to do with programs and infrastructure. And lastly, I want to thank uh, our supporters and our fans. In general, I've been absolutely thrilled with how kind people have been to both me and my family along the way.